Antonio Ibarra writes, Furious 7 broke records and was announced as the fastest movie in history to hit 1 billion. Surely the people at Marvel Studios are worried about this achievement with the worldwide release of Age of Ultron coming up. Do you think Avengers 2 can make more than Furious 7 or at least hit some major record-breaking achievement? It's a foregone conclusion. Uh, uh, Avengers uh, Age of Ultron will will crush uh, whatever results that Fast and Furious get. Um, number one, because it, it is just so highly anticipated. It's crazy. It, it is the most anticipated movie of the year, depending on who you talk to. Um, <laughs> and, and it's, it's, we can't, our review drops tomorrow, by the way, our, our review of Avengers Age Ultimate, we're going live tomorrow, but I can at least <laughs> tell you this it's, and you know, I liked Fast and Furious 7 very much. You saw my review. This is a better movie than Fast and Furious 7, and it's going to have people going back multiple times. Um, and so it, it, it won't have a problem. It will not have a problem. And no, the only thing Disney's worried about is if they beat, if they can beat the previous Avengers. Right. And remember, the previous Avengers is the number one opening weekend box office of all time. That is a high standard. It is the number three all-time box office champion worldwide. That is a high standard. So the only thing that Disney's worried about is if they can beat their last movie, not what else is uh, opening up around them. Anyway, Schnapp, how do you see it? Yeah, I think it's an interesting, uh, weird phrase, worried about. I don't think they're worried about anything. I, you know, <laughs> yeah, I mean, no. they're just sitting on a giant stack of a billion dollars. I mean, they're like, what do we, they're, a thing they're worried about is what are they going to spend that money on? That's what I, think. <laughs> I just don't know what part of the planet we're going to buy with all this money that we're going to make from Avengers Age of Ultron. Just the ceaseless, endless amount of fountain of money just pouring out for week after week after week. Billions of dollars. That's what they're worried about is how are they going to you know spend it all? I, I don't think they're worried about anything. And, and believe me, we saw the film. I can't wait to see it again. So, I mean, yeah, I'm really excited. It's going to have multiple times. So you're going to want to see it multiple times. So it's you know, I think Disney's other, worried about that fat guy in the Segway coming up, right? <laughs> <laughs> as long as he doesn't like, yeah, they don't want him to break the screen or something like, hey, get the Segway guy away. They're you know, just worried about injuring themselves if they try to jump into their pile of money like Scrooge McDuck yes. in DuckTales. Mm -hmm. Like this thing is going to crush. I think it's going to be the highest grossing weekend opening of all time. I think it's going to go over well over 200 million. I think it's probably going to be 210, 220, somewhere around there. This thing is going to demolish box office records. Mm -hmm. It might be the highest grossing film. This is a movie that can compete with Avatar for the reasons we were talking about us because because it, it is going to do repeat business. Yeah. We've all seen it and we want to see it again. And I'll probably see it twice this weekend at least, right? Yeah. So I am ready to see this film multiple times. Whereas like John, you said, Fast and Furious 7. It's a really cool movie. I still haven't seen it. But you see it once. Maybe you see it twice. But you probably have that one viewing is enough for you. And, you know, the other thing to keep in mind too is, is a uh, you know Avengers worried about it. Fast and the Furious is in its third week and it's already dropped down to twenty nine million. Oh, pff, only twenty nine million in its third <laughs> week. But still, that those aren't that isn't a pace to shatter you know big record uh, things. And by the time Avengers comes out, it's going to be in its fifth week and probably pulling in about ten million a week. So now nah, Avengers isn't worried about it at all. 